Hey, this is Marjorie, and I'm going to help you get to that note that you just think you just can't do. Like that one is just out of your range. Well, I mean, yes, maybe, but probably not. We can probably get there if we use the right placement, uh, the right vocal technique. And this is an easy trick for you to use to get there without really having to think too hard about your proper vocal technique. We're just gonna do a little whine, a little cry to slide up to the note first. And then we'll hit it head on after. All right, so we're also gonna back off of the volume. Most of the time, I guarantee you, you need to back off your volume when you're trying to get to that note that you feel like is just so big and hard and powerful. You're trying to approach it with too much volume. Pull it back and let's get it and get the coordination correct first. We'll add the volume later. So let's do a little cry up to this one and we'll say my. My, my, my. See there, starts to kind of give away from me right in the middle of my break. So, my, you have to pull off and pay attention to the placement of it. My, make sure you're not, I'm not pulling up. My, 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 and then go back and try to hit maybe that D straight on. My, you can do it. Use the little cry, the little whine. You can use different words why or now or my and try to get to that note remember always that you're going to probably need to back off of that volume at first and you can add it back in once the coordination is steady and you've gained the muscle memory to do it all the time the way you want to with freedom and ease and power have a great day